There were two major champions in the final pairing on Sunday at the Arnold Palmer Invitational presented by MasterCard, but it was first-time winner Matt Every who defied the odds and also made me a fantasy winner for the first time all season long. Thank you, Matt. But what Every's really known for on tour is not mincing his words. He says exactly what he thinks and exactly how he feels. For instance, on Saturday when talking about some of the weird style that you may see out on the course, he said, Wearing dumb clothes does not mean you have style. It simply means you're a guy wearing dumb clothes. <laughs> so if you wanted more of that raw human emotion from Matt Every, we saw it on Sunday after his win. It's just, it's tough, man. It, you just never know if it's going to happen. You get there so many times and uh, it's nice to, it's nice to get it done. Fashion and style, or lack thereof, seem to be what's trending this week, like when Kevin Na's fan club came out to the King's Place to make a statement. Look at that shirt, Kevin Na, oh, worth shit. the wait. Give me a little and love, guys. Give me some love. And then there's this guy. You can't miss him in that loudmouth clothing, even when he's trying to take a nap. He looks really comfortable, He's going to have though. to live it down. Hey ladies, if you happen to be watching this, if you could please send me that photo, I promise you it will make it up here next week because that was hilarious. But not to bring up a sore subject, I'm sure many of you remember from two years ago when Team USA was taken down by the European Ryder Cup team and Davis Love III was of course the US team captain. He said after that loss, it was something he would never forget and he meant it. Love tweeted out a photo of taking air out of one of the tires out of one of Ian Poulter's many Ferraris that he collects and he tweeted out saying, I will pay Ian Poulter back for those putts at Medina. Poulter responded by saying, easy to let air out of my tires, easier to hold those putts. And talk about the importance of positive thinking on the golf course. Will McKenzie finished up his round on Friday at two over par, which was at that point outside of the cut line in decided to pack up and head home. Mackenzie tweeted out that he drove about 100 miles back towards Jupiter, Florida, and then did a U-turn because the cut moved to two over. Man, I have this power of negative thinking down. Mackenzie did end up finishing his week at even par in a tie for 43rd, so not bad for a guy that was ready to pack up and head home, but not before the doctor at the course diagnosed him with strep throat. That's a tough weekend, buddy. But you know who else probably has kind of a sore throat? This guy. This rat snake was found in Georgia on a chicken farm and was most likely just trying to find some chicken egg dinner, but instead ended up ingesting two golf balls. So yeah, this is what a snake looks like that eats two golf balls. That'll do it for this week's Trending on Tour. We are still perfect, I think, for mentioning an animal at least once in this segment. If you want to talk about it, find me on Twitter using hashtag Trending on Tour.